The argument that adult entertainers should be required to wear condoms strikes many as uncontroversial. Condoms are proven to reduce the spread of sexually transmitted infections. And the recent HIV positive diagnoses of adult film stars Cameron Bay and Rob Daly only increased the calls for new regulations. And here's Bay at a press conference held by the AIDS Healthcare Foundation where she described her last shoot before being diagnosed. And as a warning, Bay's description is graphic. We continue to work even though he had a cut and we did not use a condom. Now, but is the call for condoms important, drowning out the voices of those most affected by the proposed requirements? In light of the most recent push to regulate the industry, some performers are saying that their right to choose is being overlooked. A Cameron Bay, the woman who you just saw speak, she was the first um, a couple months ago to come out as HIV positive um, in the industry. And as soon as that happened, the trade group in the industry placed a moratorium. And actually, before they had gotten the test results back from her boyfriend, Rod Daly, who is also a porn performer, they lifted that moratorium. But then Rod Daly's test came back positive, and then they reimposed the moratorium, so a second moratorium. And then um, a little, like a little bit after that, they lifted it again. And after they lifted the moratorium the second time, they made a, a move that's been applauded pretty much all around, which is that um, testing is now going to happen. STD testing for performers is now going to happen every 14 days instead of um, about once a month, which is what it was prior. Um, what happened was Cameron Bay's test was positive. They shut down. They, Rod Daly wasn't part of the testing because he performed on the gay side, which is a totally different protocol. Could you explain that for us, uh, you know, Sovereign, as to what it is in terms of the different standards between, um, you know, between gay porn and, like you said, straight porn, why there are different standards to begin with? Well, first of all, um, in gay porn, it tends to be condom only, um, and they don't use testing I can't really speak for, for the gay porn community. Um, I would highly recommend that you have someone like Connor or Bebon that can totally clarify this stuff. Um, but their system is condom only, and that's based on them dealing with HIV for 40 years in that community and deciding that that is a very effective way of preventing the spread of HIV. If it was up to you, uh, you know, would you prefer to, to use condoms when you are on Absolutely. set and you're making a film? Absolutely. Let me let me ask Cindy Starfall too. I mean, you also as an adult performer, do you prefer to use condoms? Would would, would you like to use condoms? You know, and um, and how high up on the list of concerns of yours is contracting HIV? I agree with Sovereign. Um, as a form performer, I want to give the best and hottest, mo most energetic scenes I can. But like you say, we don't know if the guy is going to do crossover from gay to porn. And we don't actually know all the uh, gay porn performer. So I would like um, to give an option for a condom. You know, like the girl who's allergic to condoms, she can choose if she want a condom or not. But I don't want it to be happen to always worry about, oh, who's the performer I'm working with and if he has anything. What are some of the things that happen if you do say that you want to um, choose to use a condom if you are, you know, filming something? Uh, normally, are our, our directors and the producers and everyone else, are they accepting of that? Does it put you at risk? I mean, maybe they'll find someone of else? Of course not, right? Of course not, because they're always shooting bareback. But one of the largest and most successful adult entertainment company in the industry is Condom Only, which is uh, Wicked Pictures. So they they have been successful for years, and they have been use, using condom in every movie. So why not? It could be done.